flawless victory. All right, what's up? We're reacting to a Long Legend Larry. And then I have my dad and I'm the son. I'm Ethan. <laughs> so we are reacting to Long Leg Legged Larry. It's kind of like a tongue twister. But this song right here kind of makes me think of Shrek. If you guys ever seen the movie Shrek, uh, basically this frog could either be the prince or the king. But as we all know, it's the G, which is Aesop Rock. It's kind of like a storytelling song. And uh, this song, I added the lyrics so you guys will enjoy it. And this is kind of has become the anthem in the house. Even my daughter likes this song. Yeah, the whole family basically likes this song. Yeah, so you guys stay till the very end because you will like this reaction and you guys will also like this music video. All right, let's get into the song now. <laughs> Damn, it gets quite fast. With a body length of about 20 centimeters, bullfrogs are the largest frogs in North America, as well as the champion jumpers. <laughs> Legged Larry was a frog at the pond. Jump so high, might miss him while he's gone. Jump over anything, even King Kong. Jumping Jack Flash was his favorite song. Now, once upon a time, there was a cat in a tree. Chased the squirrel up, been stuck since three. The fireman came, said it's too high for me. It's too high. How's that cat gonna ever get free? Young Jack Turner was a staple on the block. Said he knew about a frog with an XL. The neighbor started laughing, but Jackie wouldn't stop. Ran off, came back, guess who we got? Well, it was long legged Larry, didn't open his mouth. Like a rocket to the moon, through a cumulus cloud. Touchdown safe, later scaredy cat on the ground. If you listen real close, you can still hear the crowd go. So, this is like, again, this one really reminds me of Shrek. It would be dope if you were to make a whole album of Long Legged and Larry and make it into like a movie. Wouldn't you watch it? Yeah. I would watch it because it's like an ordinary frog in a pond, kind of like the ogre in Shrek. But this frog can jump super high, even over King Kong. And he is called to help out get a cat off a tree because the fireman couldn't do it, right? Yeah. And, uh, this frog could either be a prince or a king or again it represent aesop rock with the storytelling i have a feeling this song has to do with himself let's get into the second verse and then you guys tell me what you guys think yeah go larry go larry go go go, go larry go larry go larry go go get shine in the camera go go Larry doesn't care. Jump so high, grow a beard in the air. Jump over anything, even Times Square, yelling long legged Larry for mayor. Here, here. Now, once upon a time, there was a princess in a cell. In the tower of a castle, through a forest on a hill. Half the men that ever sought her out had fallen ill. All the men that ever tried to climb the wall had fell. Handful gather at the base of the place. Each claim way braver than the bravest you faced. Bunch of dingbats yapping about saving the day. But wait a Wedded amphibian face in the haze Well it was long-legged Larry on the back of a steed Lapped up yelling Jordan kissed the girl on the cheek Touchdown safe showed a lady back to her peeps If you listen real close you can still hear the streets Go Larry So this is like a mixture of Tangled and also Shrek Because in Tangled she's in a castle and it's super high and they had to climb her hair in order to get on top. Yeah, it's just but crazy in this how part, so many people died. <laughs> I know, right? But Long Legged Larry didn't need the hair; he just jumped up to the top. And also in Shrek, how many people died? And Shrek is the one that saved the day. Yeah. Let's get to the next verse. Go Larry, go, 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 go Larry. on the case jump so high pluck a star out of space jump over anything even salt lake jump into the mosh pit jump out of a cake now once upon a time there was a circus in town some went for the cotton candy some for the clowns but the high wire act was the most profound had a poodle on a unicycle rose in her mouth 10 o'clock show get the poodle in position 10 
seconds in the unicycle starts tipping out a poodle barely clinging to the wire buyer mittens but what the heck is that thing in the distance ribbit long legged larry a sight for sore eyes known to give a dog a ride seconds after he arrives touchdown safe give us some kibbles and raw hide if you listen real close you can still hear the vibe go larry go larry go 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 larry go larry go larry Kind of crazy how we found this song. So um, me and my dad were at LA, and we were scrolling through YouTube, and he found the song, and it was crazy. We all were like, we didn't even try to find it, but we pressed play, and it became one of our favorite songs. Yeah, and um, like again, this real, this, I think he should make a whole album of this and make it into like a movie series like Shrek, because it's like a, a mixture of Shrek plus the Princess and the Frog, and also Tangled. I think he can make three movies just out of this music video. If you think about it, I feel like it could be a movie. Yeah. It'd be way better than Disney. We'll Rocky. call it Aesop Rock series. Yeah. Uh, thanks for clicking on our video. I hope you guys enjoyed our reaction. And there's a lot more to come. It's just, there's a lot of stuff on our plate. But you're going to hear Tupac, Biggie, and Big L. Trust me. Those are going to take me some time because I really want to break those down and I want to hit those right on the nail because I know there's a lot of people that are going to have a lot of controversy on my reaction towards those. But I guarantee you those are going to be home runs. So stick around and make sure you're ready for the next ones that are going to come. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.